Hello everybody and welcome back to The Witcher 3. Wow, it's getting into the nits and grits of this game. Uh, find the dream in the house. Okay, so let's move on. Here. Looks like rain. As far as I know at the moment it looks. Yes, that is definitely rain. I think oh. I think we're going to need to be getting the Care Mormon armor, funnily enough, from Care Mormon. And we're nowhere near there at the moment. We're getting further and further north. But we're not there at the moment, so you know, maybe eventually we'll get it. So we can talk into the dreamer or the or whatever the thing is called. Just passing by, wanderer? Or do you seek something specific? Who's asking? Rudolf de Jonkier. Of those de Jonkiers, yes. My ancestors laid the foundations of this city. I now own its largest bank. Didn't need a recommendation. Name would have been enough. Father always said, all ought to know your merit, son. Don't hide them under a bushel. I'm looking for Corrine Tilly. Well, you've come to the right place, then. Corrine is inside. Been there for a few days, dreaming the home's history. <laughs> I'd like to go inside, look around. I don't usually let strangers rummage around my home. Twin swords, though. You're a witcher. You may enter. Call that my whim. I guess we can enter. Please, we're already dependent on the So we can loot candle, candelabrum, candelabrum. Why do they have fuck all in this house? Dealing god, there we go. Silver mug, there we go. Why the hell are they keeping phosphorus in their house? Wine stone, empty. Empty bottles, dumplings, oh well. Right, fuck it. No, we don't need to look at it anymore. Put it down, please. That's blood. Don't spill it. Please. Why have I still got witch senses to me? Stop! Go away! Ah! What the hell is happening? She is one weird fucking woman. Wake up. It's just a dream. Wake up. Okay. And was it? The doll. The attic. Okay. Quite spooky, too All spooky right. for me, so I no, Time to check case. the attic. Put it down, please. That's blood. Don't spill it. Please. Go for an apple juice. Yeah, we do. Bit of, bit of food. So how do I get to the attic? Stop. As, uh, Go away. Don't do that. Leave it. <laughs> Where the next room's blocked. Examine it. No, I don't want to loot something. Alright, how am I going to get round? Dumplings, bread, mud, lady. Why am I picking this crap up? Cow's milk. Oh, it's a Redanian lager. That sounds nice. And um, that's all Peter. Telekinetic glass. Let's try that. There we go. Drawing of a crib. Pure silver. Fucking hell, they got loads of food in here. Um, the Danian lava again. And this dust. Nice. We got the rank doll. More water. <laughs> More raspberry juice. Dark iron off. Oh. Loads of stuff. Museum the champion. 
so no idea how useful that shit is. More day in longer. Um, examine the. Yeah, let's just examine the drawing. Uh, is it in here? Nope. There's a drawing. Drawing of a quip. Crib. Paper on which a crib has been hastily drawn by a child, it seems. Is there a child around here? Strange stuff. A doll. Drawing shows it lying in a cradle. Maybe I should find one. Isn't there one right there? Does it want us to go downstairs? Lay down, please. There's blood. Don't spill it. Please. Where is the crib? Where is it? We're talking about going through here. Go away! Don't Leave it! Am I gonna do something really fucking freaky? Another masterpiece. An oven and a blackened grate. No oh, joy. A riddle. Guess I should find an oven. Examine the oven. Last race. And a mug. Where, where was the oven? Was the oven downstairs? This is actually giving me fucking goosebumps. This is freaky shit. And that's no exaggeration. I find this shit pretty damn freaky. Hmm. Boo. Oh fucking hell! It even made me jump. Did I scare you? Scared you, didn't I? Yeah, you fucking Tell did. You scared. Big brave man scared of wee little Sarah. Ain't that funny? I wouldn't do that anymore if I were you, Sarah. You might scare someone so bad they'll hurt you. Why would someone hurt me? Having a spot of fun's not allowed anymore. What are you playing? That lady fell asleep, and I've sent her some horrible dreams. I'll not her wake, neither. I can do that, you know. Funny, isn't it? Very funny. Thing is, I gotta talk to the dreamer. So I'd like you to let her wake up. Little Sarah doesn't want her to wake. Little Sarah wants to play. We know what she is. We've met one. You're lucky. I know you're a harmless godling, but others might not know. And then. And how'd you know I'm a godling, eh? How's that, eh? Eh? If it looks like one and that's like one, trust me, you're a godling. You give the dreamer nightmares and won't let her wake up. Why are you tormenting her? I'm not tormenting anyone. Scary dreams are great. What I love is when this big hen chases me. Hen's got these red. Why do you live in a haunted house? Tell you a secret. <laughs> the house ain't haunted. Not one bit. I just pretend it is. Make everyone think that. It was sitting there all empty. So I moved in. Bigwig from the bank then came and bought it. I don't like bankers, especially not to live with, so I decided to give him a scare. Gave the banker a really big scare. See, he paid a lot for this house and won't give it up easily, which is why you need to find another home. I don't want to! I don't! I won't! Sarah, Novigrad's no place for a godling, but if you want to live here, that's your business, so let's make a deal. A deal? What kind? Leave the dreamer alone. In exchange, I'll tell the banker the house is haunted. For good, no way to lift the curse. You tell him that? What if he doesn't believe you? I'm a witcher. He'll believe me. Yes. Yes. Yes! Do that and I promise not to bother your friend. Not even a little. You're awfully nice, you know. I don't hear that often. Thanks. Now go wake that sleepyhead. I won't stop her. She'll get up. In that case, let's go do it. 
We, we went the nice side of um, helping her. Sarah. There we go. Sarah the... God. Just sat there giggling again. It's not even a haunted house. She's just making weird noises. Go talk to Corrie and Tilly. Or Trilly. She's quite, she's quite, Who are quite you? Quite a nice little lady. Triss Marigold sent me to see you. Gods. Horrible nightmares. I was supposed to dream the history of this house. Instead, I saw furniture. Hungry furniture that wished to devour me. I know it must sound foolish, but in the dream, well, it was all too real and not at all amusing. Mm -hmm. The work of a godling. She made people believe the house was haunted. Also injected your dreams with her little jokes. And you managed to wake me. I feel fortunate. We witchers have our ways. Oh, we thank do. Thank you very much. The dreams, they were awful. Any way I can pay you back? There is, actually. I'm looking for a young woman who was seen in Novigrad. I can certainly try to help. But I'll need to clear my head first. After those deranged dreams, I feel it's full of cobwebs. Find me at the Golden Sturgeon. I rent a room there. All right. See you there. Oh, we're getting a pint. We're getting a pint. All right, let's <clears throat> ready ourselves for the journey to the boozer. Let's go back down the stairs and over the house. <laughs> we should probably tell the guy that it's... Yeah. I saw Miss Corrine leave, but she refused to speak to me. Is the matter resolved? Or quite the opposite? Hmm. A bit of both. A demon had captured Corrine. I managed to free her, but the house is still haunted. Did Corrine dream of the building's past? Yeah. Pretty horrid, apparently. Though she refused to talk about it. Nobody should inhabit the place. So many crowns I paid! Oh, well. It shan't put me in the poorhouse. Wonder how the many crowns he has, because I've got 500, 600 crowns. I can buy one piece of armor. I must be rich. Mm, guess not. Hopefully, eventually. Hopefully, eventually. Eventually. Yeah, we'll just stick with that. Goodbye, then. That guy just found it. Oi, beware the gutters. You mark a notice board. No need to do those. We know they'll probably get us a lot of crap. to Skilliger, at your age. Ha! No, all right, let's have a look in here. I believe I see a challenger. He seeks to serve his own personal hygiene. Maybe one day I'm that. Who knows? Who's Corrine? Where, where, where is Corrine? Oh, she's upstairs. She'll be upstairs, won't she? I have a wallop yet. Whoa! Supper, and where are the stairs? <coughs> White head like a miller's son. Getting in the way. Got it past him. Where's this? Where are the stairs? Yeah, right. She's she's renting a room. There's got to be a way up. But yet. Right, Mr. Didn't, didn't see the marker on the map at the moment. Alright, let's have a look. The other one's bound to have some free shit. Oh god, Redanian lager. Got some stout, some more water. Oh, pure silver. We're gonna have drinks for the rest of our lives. <laughs> 